Okay guys, um, today I'm going to be reviewing a wine. Um, it's called the Straw Hat Prestige Collection. As you can see, I've already gone through a bottle already, so let's just take that out of the picture. Uh, um, but yeah, um, yeah, today we're going to be reviewing the Straw Hat Prestige Collection. This is the rosy version. There is actually um, like a red version and also a white version as well. Um, but the one I have um, today is the, is the rosy version. Now, I'm not particularly a, a big fan of white wine, you know, in my opinion, it just tastes like cat piss. But uh, the rosy version and the red, the red versions are, are pretty good in my, in my, my opinion. So, uh, now, now this particular, the Straw Hat is, is a UK produced wine. So, you know, it's, um, it's kind of, I don't know whether it's a really local sort of wine, but, you know, it's, you know, kind of knitted to the UK, which is where I live, so, um, I don't know whether it'll cost more in your, in your country if you don't live in the UK, but it's, um, it's three ninety it's three ninety nine, which is, um, actually quite, um, good, um, good price for single wines in this country, but, um, it's a, it's, um, it says it here, it's a lush and fruity rosé, British wine produced from imported grape juice. So it may be produced in this country, but its ingredients most certainly come from abroad. But, uh, and it's 11% and there's 75 centiliters in a bottle. Now, um, now I, I really like this wine because I'm not actually a particularly a really um, big wine drinker because there's so many different types and there's so many different, you know, different ones that are producing, you know, all sorts of countries all over the world. And uh, you don't know what you're getting, basically. Sometimes you can get a really good one, or you can get a really crappy one. But uh, this particular one, I have to really like. So, uh, now, um, I'm just going to have a little taste of this. You know, well, I already know what it tastes like, but um, I have this really cute uh, wine glass. It's like the cutest wine glass in the world. It's like 5p, like a year ago. It says, World Wine Fair. And uh, we're just going to... Open and uh, I'm going to give a little review of how it tastes. So, uh, holding the camera and trying to pause into this thing. And, uh, that should do. So, that's the basics of the wine now. Now, the most important question is how does it taste? Now, Now the most important part of it, is with regards to taste, is that it's it's extremely smooth. It's very very. It goes down like a treat. It goes down very very easily. In fact, actually, it goes down so easily that it's almost like Ribena. You know, like that that you know, like that fruit drink that you make, like Ribena. But it's kind of like that, except it gets you drunk. So uh, it's a very very good wine. It's definitely one of my favourites. Even though I don't drink wine that often, this is definitely one of my number one choices when I want to drink some some wine and uh, and uh, yeah, um, I, I I I definitely give it a, a nine out of ten. It's a very very good wine. It basically tastes like Ribena, but except it gets you drunk. So it's a yeah, it's a very good good wine. Um, this is my first wine review. I don't know whether I'll make that much more wine reviews because. Um, I don't really drink that often, but there's, there are a few out there that I like, so, uh, yeah, the, 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 this has been my review of the Straw Hat Pre Prestige Collection. Very good wine.